Observational learning is a key concept in psychology and it delves into how individuals acquire new behaviors and skills by observing others. Hi guys, welcome to this channel. Let's understand the intricate mechanisms of this fascinating form of learning. Observational learning, also known as social learning or modeling, is a process where individuals acquire new behaviors and knowledge by observing and imitating others. This type of learning is not solely reliant on direct personal experiences but involves learning from the experiences of those around us. Albert Bandura, a renowned psychologist, is credited with developing the concept of observational learning. His influential Bobo doll experiments in the 1960s provided empirical support for the idea that individuals can learn by observing the actions and consequences experienced by others. We can find many examples of observational learning in everyday life, from children imitating parents' actions to employees learning new skills by observing their colleagues. Even the acquisition of language often involves observational learning, as individuals pick up nuances by listening to others. Observational learning has four main processes. Attention or noticing the model, retention or remembering what was observed, reproduction or recreating the observed behavior and motivation or having a reason to imitate. These components collectively contribute to the effectiveness of observational learning. Three key concepts influence observational learning which are modeling, imitation and reinforcement. Modeling refers to the demonstration of a behavior by a role model or someone in authority. The behavior of the model can influence the observer's likelihood of imitating that behavior. Positive modeling often leads to positive observational learning outcomes. Imitation is a central aspect of observational learning. Individuals replicate behaviors they have observed in others and this process plays a crucial role in the transmission of cultural practices, social norms and even complex skills. Reinforcement, both positive and negative, can strengthen the likelihood of observational learning. If an observed behavior leads to positive outcomes or rewards, the observer is more likely to imitate that behavior. Conversely, if negative consequences follow a behavior, observational learning may be inhibited. In order to understand the nature of observational learning, we must refer to the studies conducted by Bandura. In one of his well-known experimental studies, Bandura showed a film of 5 minutes duration to children. The film shows a large room with lots of toys, including a large-sized Bobo doll. Now, a grown-up boy enters the room and looks around. The boy starts showing aggressive behavior towards the toys in general and the Bobo doll in particular. He hits the doll, throws it on the floor, kicking it and sitting on it. This film has three versions. In one version, a group of children see the boy, who is the model, being rewarded or praised by an adult for being aggressive to the doll. In the second version, another group of children see the boy being punished for his aggressive behavior. In the third version, the third group of children are shown the boy being either rewarded or punished. After viewing a specific version of the film, all three groups of children were placed in an experimental room in which similar toys were placed around them. The children were allowed to play with the toys. These groups were secretly observed and their behaviors noted. It was found that those children who saw aggressive behavior being rewarded were most aggressive. Children who had seen the aggressive model being punished were least aggressive. Thus, in observational learning, observers acquire knowledge by observing the model's behavior, but performance is influenced by model's behavior being rewarded or punished. You may have noticed that children observe adults' behavior at home and during social ceremonies and functions. They enact adults in their plays and games. For instance, young children play games of marriage ceremonies, birthday parties, thief and policeman, housekeeping, etc. Actually, they enact in their games what they observe in society, on television, and read in books. Children learn most of the social behaviors by observing and emulating adults. The way they put on clothes, dress their hair and conduct themselves in society are learned through observing others. It has also been shown that children learn and develop various personality characteristics through observational learning. Aggressiveness, pro-social behavior, courtesy, politeness, diligence and insolence are acquired through this method of learning. 
Critics argue that observational learning theory may oversimplify the complexity of human behavior and underestimate the role of individual factors. Additionally, not all observed behaviors are imitated and other cognitive processes may mediate the observational learning process. Observational learning stands apart from other forms of learning such as classical and operant conditioning by emphasizing the role of observation, imitation and modeling. It underscores the importance of the social context in shaping behavior. Observational learning has practical applications in education and behavior modification. In classrooms, teachers often use modeling to demonstrate desired behaviors and in therapeutic settings, individuals may learn adaptive behaviors by observing others who exhibit them successfully. In conclusion, observational learning offers a nuanced perspective on how we acquire knowledge and skills. By dissecting the processes of observation, imitation, and reinforcement, we gain valuable insights into the social dynamics that shape our learning experiences. So that's it for this video. If you're looking for quality mental health resources, please visit my Etsy shop. The link is provided in the description box below. If you like the content of this video, please like it and subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to press the bell icon so you're notified when the next video comes out. As always, Thanks for watching.